I swear I feel like I know you, but I didn't think good thoughts about you before, but you look really nice. Hopefully you weren't yelling, cussing at the TV screen. I was. Oh, I'll make sure to let you know. You ready? Okay, so I'm going to ask you just a couple of questions, and then we're going to end with, what's your game? Like, when you're just hanging out and just, you know, kicking it, what's your game? What do you like to do? It doesn't have to be a video game. It could be anything. Hanging out. Hanging out, Hanging out with the family. we got a, one, a little over a one-year-old at home. Yeah, we've got a walking video game. I'm, 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 yeah, I'm presenting and driving back to see him. So, you know, it, that, that's our that's the only game in town right now. The days of me picking 300-pound guys up and throwing them out of the ring and doing all that kind of stuff and even actually working out are over with. So. Oh, well, you still look really good. Both you guys. I'm wearing my Goldberg Halloween costume underneath <laughs> my stuff. So. It's funny. Whenever I talk to the wrestlers, that's the attitude you get. It's like our family is our game. I guess because you're on the road so much or there's so many times that you had to be away. Yeah, that and the fact that, you know, I've done a lot of things. I play pro football. I professional wrestling. I had a couple TV shows. I've acted. You know, I'm not good at any of the, any of the above or any of the below, but um, the fact is that, you know, I wanted to get, I wanted to reach that stage in my life where I met the most wonderful woman and I, I wanted to move. I think that's me. I wanted to move, <laughs> I wanted to move into that area of my life. And so my days of working out five hours a day and all that eating 15,000, no, nah, not gonna happen. My wife, my life is dedicated to my wife and my little boy, so. Now, if we had to walk back down a memory lane just once, what would you say is one of the, like, the matches that you would just go down in your history books that this was one of my matches or one that you lost that you felt like, uh, I should have won? Well, I mean, I never lost. Uh, oh, sorry. So, no, I, I, I know I, you I lost did, a couple. I did, but they cheated. But, um, you know, it was when I wrestled Hulk Hogan in front of 42,000 people in Atlanta, and, and at the end of the night, uh, I was getting beaten up by the powers to be, and then all the Falcons, the Atlanta Falcons, who I played football with, came out and saved me. Oh, how cool! I didn't see well, that for one. Me, it was for me. It was awesome because I had always wanted to succeed in football like they did, and yet that time they wanted to be where I was. So for me, it was just the coolest thing there was. That's great. And so for tonight, um, are you just you just kind of hanging out, or are you actually I'm presenting? presenting the biggest badass award? I just don't know why it's not. I'm why would they give you that? Myself. <laughs> Are you, are you up for it? Because, I mean, I've always known you to be the biggest of them. Yeah, I'm the biggest, but I don't know the biggest of what now, so who knows. Now, will we catch you in any movies uh, anytime soon? Or are you really just kind of hanging out with the fans? I, I did a little well. cameo in this movie called Fast Class, and then my movie, I had a movie that come out came out like three weeks ago called Half Past Dead 2, and, uh, you know, auditions here and there, and uh, we'll see. We Just pray to God for Bull Run uh, Season 2. Will you go ahead and just hang out with your family? And I'm so excited to see both of you. She's beautiful, and you have a great, you have a good thing here. Good thing. <laughs> you have a great evening. This is Goldberg. You're watching The Weekend Gamer. Don't turn the channel, or I'll kill you. Sorry. There you go. That should do it.